Misractor. All right. Hey, one thing that I wanted to mention, uh, one of our listeners uh, sent us along a, an interesting little event. Whoa, whoa. Should we have announcer men say this is a hate letter? The is a hate letter of the week. Somebody making fun of a show for you. I don't think it's one of those kind of letters. Oh, I mean, okay. I'll, it, I'll. We do. I mean, that's mostly what we get, but this is actually a different one than that. All right. Never yeah. mind. <laughs> one of our listeners from the beautiful... I have no idea where this town is, actually. It's somewhere in England. I was going to give a north, south, central, whatever kind of a description of it, but I don't even know. I've heard the name of it a lot of times, although now looking at it, I'm not even sure if if you pronounce it the way that I think you do. But the wonderful little town of Reading, England, she's talking about an event that is going on, and she says that it would be good for us to mention because she's certain we have a large following in Reading, Berkshire and the surrounding area. Now, you're sure it's pronounced Reading? Because the location is the R-E-A-D-I-N-G Central Library. Now, it would be ironic <laughs> if it weren't pronounced Reading, I think. Well, maybe it wouldn't be ironic. I, <laughs> it's a good name for a library, though, the Reading Central Library. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> How do you get Reading out of R E A D? I don't know. How do you get Berkshire out of Berkshire? Come on. I've been called a Burke, but not a Berkshire. You bloody Burke. All right, all sure. right. So it's something that's going on in, in Reading, which is not in California, but is actually in England somewhere. She says that uh, it, it's even right close to the train station. So for those of you who fancy making the 30 minute train ride up to the, uh, the, Railroad. <laughs> making the 30 minute trailer. Shit. Making Take the, two. Making the 30 minute trail. Train. Take three. Making the 30 minute train ride up from uh, London. You can experience this wonderful. And you know, sometimes you just got to get out of London. It's. Get, 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 get out of London. All right, folks. Okay. Now, but what is it that's going it's on? It's 30 minutes from London? By train. That's. Close. Well, see, the, I, the, growing, uh, growing up in L.A., the, <laughs> losing my innocence in L.A., anything 30 minutes from L.A. is still L.A. <laughs> of course, that's traffic. <clears throat> yeah. I, I don't think you're taking a train 30 minutes from L.A. Now, is you're it, driving you, a car 30 minutes from L.A., which means you're just down the street. <laughs> that's true. Now, is it an actual train or is it the tube? You know, we've already gone way beyond my knowledge of this subject. Should we be falsifying English accents right now? <laughs> Maybe that would be appropriate. So anyways, with all this buildup, you're surely so excited to find out what this event may even be. Well, we haven't even told people what the event we is? We haven't at all. We've just we've been given the directions. BSing. We've told them when it is. We've, we've told we've... them how long it takes to get to Reading from London. <laughs> the event is a... A seasonal celebration of the works of cult author H. P. Lovecraft. With readings and talks from authors and experts reflecting upon his influence on popular culture. There will also be a special screening of Call of Cthulhu. Not the Metallica song. Oh, what? Well, hopefully they'll the, play this Metallica song as well. The film adaptation. You know, she said that they were going to be playing perhaps even some of our Lovecraftian episodes. <laughs> what will they do in the second five minutes? Oh, maybe we should mention that this is unascertained that sent us this, and that she is a librarian. That's right, a she's, librarian. She's a most sexy librarian. <laughs> and I guess she is organizing the celebration of Lovecraft, which is kind of cool. Uh, and it's on the 4th of December, uh, which is a Saturday. 4th of December from 12 to 6 p.m. at the Reading Rainbow Library. Take a look. It's in a book. <laughs> a Reading Rainbow. Oh, wait. I think I mispronounced it. Reading Central Library. Now, I believe tickets are L3 or L2 <laughs> with the library card. I'm what sorry. What is that? Am Cursive I reading, L. Am I reading that wrong? <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, L is Spanish for the. So I'm assuming. <laughs> I think it's three quid. Or just two quid if you've got a library card. All right, all right. So just head on over. Three quid, that's a great price for a bunch of Lovecraft. 
Lovecraft was American, by the way. I don't give a damn. <laughs> All right. Yeah, sorry for the unprofessionalism of this uh, <laughs> promo, but, but we she needed, didn't send us anything. We needed it to fit in with the rest of the show, ah, so true. we couldn't suddenly become professional. I would just throw people off completely. They'd be like, holy crap, what did I push skip? But, you know, if you are in the area, that would be pretty cool just to go and, and hang out with other fans of Lovecraft or... or fans of fiction and find unascertained and, and share your love for the, uh, I can't even sell it. Nobody's <laughs> love for the Doonstie <laughs> audio fiction magazine. Share your tolerance of the Doonstie together. Yeah. We once talked about where, uh, you know, it's funny that she mentions that we, she's sure we have a big following in Reading. We looked at the stats that we had and it had like a bunch of places where we have more listeners than in other places. And strangely, San Antonio, Texas was one of the highest. Right. Second uh, only to Reading, Berkshire, apparently. <laughs> but London was a pretty far up there as far as that goes. And we talk about this all the time, but Americans have this uh, misconception. I, I'm not even going to say misconception. We have a preconception that uh -huh. Brits are very educated. Okay. That they're, they're smarter so than us. It's that amazing that they'd be listening to our No, show. no. I just, you know, they're, <laughs> they're much more, they're, 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 they look better naked. Uh, no, no. Besides that, though, they're they're just better read than us. Uh -huh. they're, they're more literate, and, right? And so maybe there would be more fiction fans. In uh, I'm I will be quiet now. That's possible. Be a lot of stutters. You're going to have to edit out of that whole sentence. But in the end, I'm sure it'll come across. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, if you are in the area, anywhere close by, Glasgow. I believe Barcelona is yeah, very Barcelona near Barcelona is just to a, a, a good train ride. Oh, uh, Prague, if you're anywhere close by, just swing on over there and uh, check it out. You could probably go to that Thluinuinuigagog while you were there just to, uh, to make a whole Doonstief uh, adventure out of How it. How in the deuce do you still remember <laughs> that? That was our third episode, folks. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Now, I, I'm, by the way, librarian, next time just send us a script. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that way it wouldn't suck so bad. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for, for that. And now on with the show. It's in a book, a reading rainbow. 